Hello students, I hope you all are studying well and enjoying every moment of your studies and you all have subscribed to this channel, You Will Classes. Please don't forget to press the bell icon and switch on all the notifications. Now, why am I here today? Because board ek naya paper style leke aa gaya hai. You can see lots of numbers over here and bohot hi complex dekhega tumhe ye paper style and that is why I'm here to make it very simple for all of you. Now you all would be wondering ke why suddenly board is coming up with this type of a paper style. Achanak aisa kya ho gaya? Bhai iska answer to kisi ko pata nahi hai. Wo board ke mahan log hai jinhone ye बनाया है नया पेपर स्टाइल उनको ही पता होगा कि क्या पर्पज है एनीवेज इस नए पेपर स्टाइल का इन दिस पेपर स्टाइल वी आर गोइंग टू बी बेनिफिटेड आल्सो एंड देर आर सम डिसएडवांटेजेस आल्सो सो आई विल बी डिस्कसिंग सो मेनी थिंग्स रिगार्डिंग द न्यू पेपर स्टाइल नाउ आई विड लाइक टू कीप माई वीडियो लेक्चर इन हिंदी प्लस इंग्लिश सो दैट जो स्टूडेंट्स है और उनके पेरेंट्स है दोनों प्रॉपरली समझ सके कि ये पेपर स्टाइल क्या है एंड अकॉर्डिंगली अपनी पढ़ाई का प्लानिंग कर सके अब ये बहुत सारे नंबर्स है बट यू डोंट नीड टू वरी बिकॉज नाउ आई एम योर टू मेक इट सिंपल फॉर यू नाउ यू कैन सी ओवर योर दैट टोटल मार्क्स विदाउट ऑप्शन एंड टोटल मार्क्स विथ ऑप्शन नाउ विदाउट ऑप्शन इज लाइक कि देर विल बी नो इफ देर वॉज नो ऑप्शन then what was the weighted to isko hame totally ignore kar dena hai we are going to see this new paper style which is with option now i would like you all to take a piece of paper and a pen and start writing the name of the chapter and the breakup of marks for that particular chapter to i can share all these things with you i can share a pdf i can make all these things for you but ये तुम्हें मदद नहीं करेगा मैं चाहता हूं कि तुम खुद एक बार ये लिखो बिकॉज आई स्ट्रॉन्गली बिलीव जो लिखेगा वो ही सीखेगा तो ये वीडियो के साथ साथ यू ऑल्सो नोट डाउन नेम ऑफ द चैप्टर एंड द वेरियस मार्क्स एंड सम इम्पॉर्टेंट पॉइंट्स आई एल बी शेयरिंग विथ यू ओवर योर सो वी स्टार्ट विथ द फर्स्ट चैप्टर आई एम श्योर यू ऑल नो दैट स्टैटिस्टिक्स इज ऑफ टू पार्ट आई थिंक अब तक तो पता चल ही गया होगा कि स्टैटिस्टिक्स इज ऑफ टू पार्ट्स ओके जोकिंग नाउ स्टैटिस्टिक्स में फर्स्ट पार्ट इज फोर चैप्टर्स एंड सेकंड पार्ट इज फाइव चैप्टर्स नाउ विल गो वन बाय वन सी ये पूरा जो पीछे स्क्रीन में आपको दिख रहा है वो बहुत ही कंफ्यूजन क्रिएट कर सकता है तो लेट सिंप्लीफाइड वी स्टार्ट विथ द फर्स्ट चैप्टर सो इन योर बुक please write down the name of the chapter that is index number now this is the first chapter index number and in index number you write 2 plus 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 3 plus 5 which is equal to 16 2 plus 1 3 3 and 2 5 5 and 6 11 and 5 16 so now index number chapter will have a weightage of 16 marks now you can see 2 ke upar maine yellow mark kiya hai now yellow mark means the first question section a that is multiple choice question the good part of the new paper style is they have not changed the section so a b c d e f remains the same so 2 plus 1 now i would also like you to underline 2 plus 1 Now, aisa kyu hai? I'll tell you at the end of the video. It is very important for you all. So you have two plus one. Two is MCQ. One is answer in one liner. Answer answer in one sentence or it's a one liner. Now, one liner does not mean ke sir, ek line khatam hua likhne ka to ruk jaane ka. Arey bhai, nahi. One line means pura ek statement. Or कहीं पे एक्सप्लेनेशन करने के लिए तुम्हें दो तीन लाइन भी यूज करना पड़े तो करना ओके यू शुड नॉट मिस आउट ऑन दिस के वन लाइन मींस ओनली वन लाइन सो जस्ट डोंट गो विद दिस वन लाइनर थिंग नाउ नेक्स्ट इज टू मार्क्स क्वेश्चन 
then three marks question, four marks, and section F is of five marks. So over here, index number two plus one. 2 mark ka ek question, 3 mark ka ek question, again 3 mark ka ek question, plus 5. Yani 3 plus 3, whenever you see this repeat, repeat means there are options, okay? And plus 5. Plus 5 means 5 mark ka only one question will come from index number. So total is 16. We go to chapter number 2. The chapter number 2 and 3 are both connected. Chapter number 2 is linear correlation. Now, just for the sake of making it easy, we don't say linear correlation, we say only correlation. Now, in the chapter correlation, again 2, so 2 is multiple choice question. Now, plus 1, 1 is again a one-liner, then 2 marks ka equation, plus 3 marks ka equation, plus 5, 5 ke 2 questions. Now, what is 5 plus 5? It means... There will be two questions from this chapter correlation, which will be five marks each. So long questions will be there. There will be two long questions. So two plus one plus two plus three plus five plus five, which is equal to 18 marks. Now correlation ka next stage. Correlation is a relation between two variables. But now using the relationship, we are going to predict, we are going to forecast, we are going to estimate. And for that, we have this chapter regression. Now regression again, but the weightage is different in regression as compared to correlation, even though they are connected chapters. So regression again, two marks plus one mark. I'll again underline this. SRQ, I'll tell you at the end of the video, plus two marks ka single question. Now again, three plus three plus five, which is equal to 16. Are, I hope you all are noting this down. I hope you all are noting this. Ye aapko likhna hai. All of you, you need to write this. Okay? Acha, likhne mein aap textbook ka jo index hai, usme bhi ye breakup lik sakte hai. Now, we come to the fourth chapter of part one, that is time series. Now, in time series, you have two marks, multiple choice question, one mark, one liner. So, one liner is not one. It can be more also, okay? So, one liner plus two mark a single question, three mark a single question, but then now you have two big questions from time series that is 5 plus 5. So total comes to 18. Again, I'll underline 2 plus 1. Highlight it. And 5 plus 5. So two questions where there will be options. Now, part 1 is over. The total of part 1 you can see over here is a total of 68 marks. So part 1 68 marks you can see over here 16 and 18 34 16 and 18 34 so this total comes to 68 marks now we go to part two so part one over part two first chapter is probability the very important chapter dear students probability is part of mathematics which you have already done in your 10th standard as well and an important chapter because lots of entrance exam preparation has this chapter probability as a part of quantitative aptitude so very important chapter not just from board but from your further academic courses also now in chapter one probability of stats part two you have 2 plus 1 which is standard, so I'll underline this, plus 2 marks, plus 3 plus 3 plus 3. So now you will have 3 questions of 3 marks each, which totals to 9 marks. You have options over here, you can see 3 plus 3 plus 3. So there are 3 questions which can be either included all the 3 or some questions may be eliminated. So here, Aapka chapter ka breakup thoda typical hai. You don't have a 4 mark question. You don't have a 5 mark question. But you have 
थ्री मार्क्स के थ्री क्वेश्चन टू मार्क्स का एक क्वेश्चन सो टोटल ओवर ईयर इज फोर्टीन मार्क्स चैप्टर टू रैंडम वेरिएबल नाउ अगेन चैप्टर वन चैप्टर टू एंड चैप्टर थ्री आर ऑल कनेक्टेड विथ ईच अदर दे आर कनेक्टेड चैप्टर्स सो चैप्टर टू रैंडम वेरिएबल एंड डिस्क्रीट प्रोबेबिलिटी डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन नाउ यर देर इज अ टिपिकल थिंग वॉट आई हैव सीन इज यू हैव मल्टीपल चॉइस क्वेश्चन ऑफ थ्री मार्क्स सो अगेन थ्री प्लस वन ऑलरेडी अंडरलाइन प्लस टू प्लस थ्री प्लस थ्री ऑप्शन विच कम्स टू ट्वेल्व मार्क्स नॉर्मल डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन दैट इज चैप्टर थ्री सो वी हैव थ्री चैप्टर्स टूगेदर प्रोबेबिलिटी random variable normal distribution dear students all these three chapters are not going to end in 12th standard they are going to come in your further academic courses also this can come for ca course for entrance exam preparation for bba even for mba so these three are important chapters now normal distribution again 3 plus 2 now 3 is three multiple choice question प्लस टू इज वन वन मार्क वन लाइनर के दो क्वेश्चन वन लाइनर के दो क्वेश्चन प्लस फोर प्लस फोर सो इफ आई काउंट द नंबर ऑफ क्वेश्चन ओवर यो थ्री प्लस टू फाइव सिक्स सेवन सेवन क्वेश्चन एंड थर्टीन मार्क्स नाउ ऑल दीज थ्री चैप्टर्स विच आर कनेक्टेड आर डन we come to chapter number 4 that is limits now limits and differentiation again they are connected chapters with each other so if you are saying ki i want to do sir differentiation we cannot directly do differentiation first we have to do limits now chapter 4 limits again 2 plus 1 so 2 mcq and one one liner then 2 2 marks ke two question and four mark a single question here you can say four mark single question so there will not be any option within the chapter okay there will be options in four mark questions but not within the chapter so this totals to 11 marks i hope you all are writing all these things very important ki aap ye sab likhe okay dear students i am saying this again and again acha ye mat bhulna ki is channel ko bhi subscribe karna hai ओके बिकॉज ऐसे बहुत सारे वीडियोस आ रहे हैं इस चैनल में आप सबके लिए सो so दैट आपका ये स्टडिंग एक्सपीरियंस मेमोरेबल रहे ये जितने भी चैप्टर्स हैं उसके वीडियो लेक्चर्स जो यूविल के स्टूडेंट्स हैं उनको यूविल का जो ऐप है उसके अंदर अवेलेबल है और जो नॉन यूविल स्टूडेंट्स है वो ये सब वीडियो लेक्चर्स देख सकते हैं फ्रॉम अवर ऐप यू विल लर्न ऐप विच इज अवेलेबल ऑन एंड्रॉयड available on iOS and also available as a desktop version so if you have not downloaded those apps please download so that ye chapters bhi agar aapko padhna hai revise karna hai seekhna hai fir se to bahut hi wonderful videos available hai aap logo ke liye now chapter number 5 the last chapter differentiation it is again two marks plus one mark Plus two marks, plus three, plus four. I hope by now you have understood that two plus one is two marks MCQ, one mark one liner, plus two marks ka single question, plus three, plus four. So this is how the breakup of differentiation is, which is of total twelve marks. Now we can see over here in the screen that sixty-eight marks is for part one. and 62 marks is for part 2 so total comes to 130 now let's check it out 14 plus 12 plus 13 so 25 and 14 is 39 and 11 so 50 and 12 62 marks so we have totally reconciled all these things but very important note see ye jo breakup ये जो एनालिसिस हमने किया है ओके ऐसा एनालिसिस इज नॉट डायरेक्टली गिवन बाय द बोर्ड बोर्ड हैज एक्टेड वेरी स्मार्ट 
बोर्ड हैज गिवन अ मॉडल क्वेश्चन पेपर एक मॉडल क्वेश्चन पेपर दिया है वो भी गुजराती में उस बेस पे वी हैव डिजाइन दिस सो हंड्रेड परसेंट रिलायबिलिटी जैसे अपने बोर्ड का नहीं है वैसे इस बोर्ड के दिए हुए पेपर स्टाइल का भी नहीं है तो इफ यू आर लकी एंड आई एम श्योर यू विल भी इतना तो भरोसा रख सकते हैं बोर्ड पे कि ऑलमोस्ट नाइनटी नाइन परसेंट जितना ऐसा ही होगा हो सकता है कोई क्वेश्चन ऊपर से नीचे इधर से उधर ये चैप्टर से वो चैप्टर जा सकता है दैट इज पॉसिबल बट एट लार्ज दिस शुड सॉल्व द पर्पज नाउ वंस अगेन अ रैपिड रिकैप इंडेक्स नंबर 16 मार्क्स को रिलेशन एटीन मार्क्स रिग्रेशन सिक्सटीन मार्क्स टाइम सीरीज एटीन मार्क्स सो कंप्लीट पार्ट वन इज सिक्सटी एट मार्क्स प्रोबेबिलिटी फोर्टीन रैंडम वेरिएबल ट्वेल्व नॉर्मल डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन थर्टीन लिमिट्स इलेवन एंड डिफ्रेंसिएशन ट्वेल्व सो सिक्सटी टू मार्क्स इज पार्ट टू नाउ आई told you that we are underlining over here 2 plus 1 2 plus 1 3 plus 1 3 plus 2 and 2 plus 1 everywhere now why i have done this see over here these mcqs and one liner so section a and section b iske andar you can see that yahan pe there will be no options for you so there are 12 there are total 20 question 20 marks there are 10 one liner 10 marks now you cannot play around with this okay because these are all compulsory questions ye jo 30 marks ka objective hai this 30 marks objective there will not be any options and that's why i have paired them over here underlined them it is very important here you cannot do some study planning jo advantage hai is uh, paper style ke waise ki ek chapter ko hum chhod denge to kya sir chalega agar ye do chapter chhod diye to tum pura chapter ideally you cannot quit now ye jo humne analysis kiya hai uske upar kafi sara aur bhi analysis kiya hai ki how you can score well how you can plan your studies because students if you will not plan then you will be putting in lots of efforts which may go futile ho sakte wo efforts ka zarurat hi nahi tha so if you play if you fail to plan you plan to fail obviously gujarat board mein aisa nahi hota ki koi fail ho jaye we are so thankful to the board and now with this new paper style but the idea is Okay, now you need to do some planning so that you can focus and you can get the maximum marks from this subject statistics so i would like to say at the end of this session to you all that you write this you go through this you try to understand catch a hold of it go through the chapter see kon kon se question 3 marks mein aate hai kon kon se question 5 marks mein aate see how you can plan for this how you can prepare for this our strategy videos our guidance videos for this subject statistics will come later on so you be with us connected with you will classes channel okay please once again i'm telling you subscribe if you have not because lots of content is going to come on this channel and i'm sure you guys have really geared up now only 16 to 17 weeks are left for your board exams and you would have started working hard now along with working hard we will teach you how you will be working smart so till then okay take care study well see you all god bless and accounts ka aisa video aa raha hai bahut jald okay so keep connected bye bye see you